Annyeonghaseyo! I'm Rasa Mejai Vilicilio and I'm from Davao City. My friends call me Mai and I've been a member of Kaliwet Performing Artists Collective Incorporated since 2009. Our group, by the way, is called Yutanggi Panaad, which means the land of promise. For this year, CPI training too came from Davao City and that's Marjorie Olanday, my group mate, currently a teacher at Santa Ana National High School and a specialist in the special program in the arts. I also have with me Hani Villegas and Neil Camacho, CPI alumni from 2018 and 2019 respectively. Hani helped us with the structure of the play while Neil was the one in charge of our live music. Aside from Neil, we tapped some of our colleagues to assist us with the music during the play. So we have Karen Ramos and Chris Julian in action. I had been invited before to perform on stage in Incheon, Korea by the CPI participants Philippine team of 2018. And I witnessed some of their classes and from that moment, I found that the CPI training is really interesting. Not only that, you can impart ideas and cultural practices to your colleagues as well. So when I heard that they would be hosting an online training program this year, I didn't hesitate at all to join because this is what I look forward to. Though this year's training was only done online, the new ideas imparted to us by the amazing professors didn't make it any less than the regular training. It was so much fun that I was amazed at what today's technology could do with the art itself. My perspective towards art has broadened and it has given me a new opportunity to blend art and technology. Of course, our classes with the narrative technique were a bit hard for me because I'm not a good writer at all. It's not in my bloodline really. But I enjoyed and learned so much from our telepresence classes. There were a lot of discussions that were meaningful, meaningful for me and I'm fortunate to be one of the participants. Since this era we're living in promotes the arts in different fields through technology, I want to introduce my CPI experience first with my organization and then later on we'll talk other artists to be open-minded about learning this new medium. As you know, we have colleagues that are actually not that good in terms of using the new technology like using gadgets and stuff like that. So I want to encourage them that this is vital for us nowadays, for us to continue to do our craft whenever, wherever. With that, if every artist in our hometown can connect with the medium trend, then promoting Philippine culture wouldn't be as hard as the pandemic started. Because we have to admit, we had a hard time adjusting to the new setup when COVID broke out. So I'm not saying that the online trend is the only way we can share our craft and culture. We just have to grab the opportunity the online platform offers.